To the latest in Morocco, the death toll there continues to rise to over 2,800 following one of the deadliest earthquakes to hit that country. South Korea's offer to provide medical assistance is among the many pledges of support flying in from around the world. Our Moon Hyeon has the details. Following the strongest earthquake to hit Morocco in nearly a century, offers of disaster relief have been coming in from around the world, including South Korea. According to a representative from the Ministry of Foreign Affairs on Tuesday, Seoul has pledged to dispatch the Korea Disaster Relief Team to provide medical assistance, as well as two million U.S. dollars worth of humanitarian aid. While the offer has been communicated to the Moroccan government, local authorities have been slow to accept assistance as it claims it needs to coordinate aid based on the needs of the field. Currently, it has only accepted surge and rescue teams from Spain, Qatar, the United Arab Emirates and the United Kingdom. The 6.8 magnitude earthquake which hit the center of the country on Friday has resulted in a death toll of more than 2,800 as of Monday. The worst affected area is the province of al Hayuz, where nearly 1,500 people have died due to the fact that it's located at the foot of the Atlas Mountains and includes remote villages and settlements that have been challenging for rescuers to reach. 2,562 others have also been reported as injured. And with the golden time ticking down and rescuers struggling to get to the victims, there are fears the death toll could rise even further over the next several days. And with so many hard-to-reach areas, authorities have not yet issued any estimates for the number of people missing. The World Health Organization said more than 300,000 people have been affected by the earthquake. In addition to human casualties, historical sites such as the Tinmel Mosque and Marrakesh's Old City has been severely damaged from the tremors. Moon Hye-ryeon, Arirang News.